Alano Español. Alano Español or Spanish Alano, English, Spanish Alant, is a large breed of dog of the Molosser dog type, originating in Spain. The dogs have been used as cattle catch dogs, hunting, and guarding. The breed is also known for its former use during Spanish bullfights, and is sometimes called the Spanish Bulldog in English. History The name of the breed comes from the Iranian tribe of Alani, nomadic pastoralists who arrived in Spain as part of the migration period in the 5th century. These peoples were known to keep large livestock guardian dogs and pursuit dogs which became the basis for the many regional Alon types. The first written reference to the breed in Spain is in a chapter of the 14th century book of the hunt of Alfonso XI, Libro de la Monteria de Alfonso XI, in which hunting dogs called Alani are described as having beautiful colors. Dogs of this type traveled with Spanish explorers and were used as war dogs, as was their role in Eurasia before migration, in the subjugation of Indian, Native American, peoples, as well as in the capturing of slaves. Bull baiting, done in the bullfighting ring with dogs of this type, was recorded by Francisco de Goya in his series on La Tormaquia in 1816. It was outlawed in 1880. Alanos were also used for hunting big game such as wild boar and deer. The Alana was used as a catch dog in Monteria style hunting. Basically there are two groups of people with dogs. The chase dogs, which are a different breed than the Alano, flush out the prey, and chase them towards the second group of men and dogs. The Alana was used for catching the game when they arrived. In 1840, the English dog dealer Bill George imported a Spanish bulldog he called Big Headed Billy. He was used to increase size in English bulldogs. In 1880, Use of dogs in the bullfighting ring was outlawed, so the breed numbers began to dwindle as the work they performed began to change. Big game became rare, stockyards were modernized and no longer needed dogs to hold the cattle, using dogs in bullfights was outlawed, and by 1963 Alanos were thought to be extinct. Dot. Recognition In the 1970s a group of fanciers and veterinary students made house-to-house -house calls in western and northern Spain. They found a few examples of the dogs in the Basque areas of Incartaria and Cantabria that were being used to herd semi-wild cattle and hunt wild boar. A breed standard was written and the dogs were documented and bred. In the early 1990s, breeders were involved in the recovery process of the small vulnerable population, and in 1995 the breeders organized into Asociación Nacional de Criadores de Alano Español, the National Association of Breeders of Spanish Alano. The Alano Español was recognized as an independent breed by Real Sociedad Canina de España, the Spanish Kennel Club, in 2004, and studies at the University of Córdoba clarify the Alano as distinct from any other breed at the genetic level. The Spanish Ministry of Agriculture, Ministerio de Agricultura, Pesca y Alimentación, recognizes the Alano Español as an indigenous Spanish breed. The breed in Spain is still small in number and the breed has not yet been recognized by the Federación Sinológica Internacional. Examples of the Alano Español have been exported to North America where a few breeders are promoting it for its temperament and hunting ability. Similar breeds Large dogs that are similar in appearance and may share the history of the Alano Español include the Molossers of the Canary Islands such as the Doco Canario, Perro de Presa Canario, as well as the Mastin Español, Spanish Mastiff and the Doco Español, Spanish Doco. Among some of the South American breeds, descended from these dogs after brought by the Spanish explorers and conquistadors are Cimarron Uruguayo, Doco Argentino, the extinct Piro de Pelea Cordobes and possibly, the Fila Brasileiro. Description Appearance The Alano Español is a very large dog of the Molosser type, with a large, strong head. Males should be no smaller than 58 centimeters, 23 in, at the withers, and should weigh 34 to 40 kilograms, 75 to 88 pounds, with females somewhat smaller. The coat is short and thick but never velvety, and is most often a brindle of any color, Leonardo, fawn, black and brindle, sable wolf. White chest flashes are acceptable but prevalence of white is not. The face may or may not have a black mask. The head is the shape of a cube and is brachycephalic. The muzzle is short with the lower jaw slightly concave, and has a very large, broad, black nose. The ears are set high and may be drop or cut short. The skin is very thick, with neck folds and some wrinkles on the face. Despite the sometimes used English name, the Alano is not a bulldog, it should never have a flat muzzle or show signs of prognathism. 
The craniofacial proportion should be 65-35, meaning a significantly longer muzzle than for instance the boxer has. Health No record or history of health issues in the breed. Temperament Since the breed was used for hunting in packs, it is very sociable with other dogs. All large dogs must be well socialized with humans and other animals when young, if they are to be safely kept as pets. Large working dogs, such as the Alano Espanol, need regular training and activity all of their lives, need regular training and